An estimated 400 families are to have their houses demolished in Osaka's John Lane compound. The demolition is to facilitate for the construction of a motor vehicle assembly plant by Prestige Motors Limited. Government has given the motor company the land on which the affected houses are built through the intervention by some senior government officials as correspondences made available to Movie TV News indicates. Government is excited with a promise by the company of creating 1,000 jobs for the locals. But residents are against the pending demolition, not even the promise of compensation will change their minds. So to Alisadi Shanya Mutima Mies, Nishi, Valetu Tuala Quisa, no Mendeto Terra, no Musama Fiashi, Mamma Letu Lubula, Mara Tubula, in your committee, they are Pilar Mobu, not we can not play why I'm known in the window. Nidia, Puruwa, Utangani Tandis, and if I can and I don't know Maria Napoleon and I don't know what I said to Bailan and Napoleon. The residents have the support of their area member of parliament, Kanil Gerichanda, who ironically has differed with his government's decision to support the project. BF is a party for the poor. And as area member of parliament, I make an undertaking and I make a commitment. I promise you, nobody, and I say nobody, is going to demolish a single house in Kenya. Any single house in John Lane is going to be demolished over my dead body. Government is now torn in between. Residents have been assured by their member of parliament, while on the other hand, the investor is desperate as time is ticking out in plans for commencement of construction works. Kenneth Perry, Movie TV News, in Osaka.